So this training is for you if you want to quit your job in the next six months. If you're currently employed in nine to five or corporate and you feel totally unfulfilled, you want to take charge of your own destiny, you don't enjoy what you do, you're sick of having a boss, someone telling you where to be, where to go, what time to be there, and you want to work for yourself, then this business model is insane. A home staging business is the thing for you if you have all those feelings about your current role, you're looking for something new, and you're obsessed with interior design. You love designing your own home, or many of your friends have said, this is what you should do for a living. Well, let me let you in on a little secret, and that secret is you can build this alongside your nine to five, while still bringing in that salary, while still earning that income, build this along the side, so that over the space of six months, you're then ready to fire your boss, you're ready to leave your job and do this completely full time. So in today's training, I'm gonna walk you through what that process looks like. It's a three step process. I'm gonna share with you financials, how to know when to leave, and then also how to create a plan so that you can leave. So guys, for me, I have never been employed. Actually, a fun fact, I've been employed for a total of three days in my whole life. I am literally the definition of unemployable. <laughs> and, you know, I've always wanted to be an entrepreneur. I've always had my own business from when I was 16. But I had this very, you know, fancy carrot dangled when I was 16 years old and I was attending property networking events with the idea of starting my home staging business. I was actually asked if I wanted to train to become a mortgage advisor and I had that very you know sexy salary offered to me at 16 years old after I left school and I thought oh my god to be earning at the time it was only 20,000 pounds but oh my god that would be really cool to have that income for showing up to a nine to five. I literally lasted three days and I had to leave. I couldn't get used to someone telling me what time I had to go for lunch. I thought that if you work nine to five, you could maybe work, you know, eight to four and then leave at four, but it wasn't the way that it worked or skip your lunch hour and then finish an hour early. And I quickly realized that that wasn't the case. And also when they said that I had like 30 days holiday a year, I was like, I'm out. But I realized I was unemployable and I realized I had this incredible business model in my mind to launch a home staging business. And I could do that from zero with no startup funds, no experience, no portfolio. And I could make it work with the business model that I had designed. So for me, my story is that I just launched this from zero with no income. But for you, your story may be that you're currently employed and you want to build this on the side of what you're doing so that you have that security that when you quit your job in six months that you've had that income to support you through that time but you've now built up your replacement income so that when you leave you're totally secure with your business income because i understand that we have outgoings and families and things we need to cover so for not not everybody it's an option just to go cold turkey hold their feet to the fire and completely quit their job but there is a way to build it up alongside what you're doing. And the reason I know that is because obviously I built it from zero, but I've helped hundreds of women personally, and thousands of women through their online programs to replace their income through their staging business. So what I wanna share with you is I wanna share with you what you need to do in order to do this in six months time. Six months time is half a year. Six months is around about 24 weeks. Depending on what month it is, it might be more weeks or it might be, you know, 24. But let's break it down. If I had 24 weeks to build this alongside my business, what I'm currently doing, sorry, alongside my job, how would I do it? Now, I believe there's a few things that need to be in place or a few things you need to know, almost like principles, 
for you to be able to do this. And the first thing that you need to know is you need to know the finances. You need to know the numbers. We need to have a plan in place. This just isn't, in six months I'll leave my job and I'll make it happen. This has to have a structure to it. So I'm gonna walk you through that structure. So the first part is the numbers. Now I'm gonna use my board here to walk you through the numbers of your staging business and how you can build this using zero of your own money. You don't need to even have an income to make this work. You can do it from zero. And that's what I'm gonna walk you through. I'll use my business, my journey as an example, and then I'll take you through our formula. Does that sound good? Okay, so when I first launched my business, I had no money. I was 16, I hadn't had a job before, so I literally had zero to get started. But I created this business model that really worked. So I, when I got my first client, what I did was I charged them 2000 Now, what am I charging them 2000 for? I'm charging them 2000 to stage their property. And this was a two bedroom apartment. So I charged them 2000 Now your question might be, but Liv, how did you actually get any of the furniture to stage that property if you had no money? Well, this payment here, this 2000 was paid to me up front. So before I'd even put a sofa into the property, I got paid this payment up front. Now when I got paid it, I used it to buy the kit. So I used that payment to buy all of the furniture, right? Now what happens is, when I buy the kit, is what we refer to, I then place it into the property for six weeks. You're staging properties for sale. That means that the person is not buying the furniture from you, they are renting it from you. And the standard rental period is around six weeks. So this means I bought this kit and I spent the 2000, which meant at the end I had zero. But I was renting it to them, I owned the kit. Meaning once the six weeks is over, and I got my next client, a lot of what I was about to earn was gross profit. So this was my first, I got my second client, and for example, let's say I charged them the same amount. I charged them 2000. Now, I already have the kit, because they just rented it from me. I own this kit. And so what I done from here, is I moved this kit from property one, to property two, and when I got paid 2000 I didn't have to buy the kit, my only expenses to move it were 200 Now this is an example number, I always take 10% of what you're charged as a removal fee, as a removal expense, but it's often a lot cheaper than this. I pay someone to take my furniture at 45 an hour. So if this is just getting moved, even two hours, it would be 90, right? But I take 10% because then I'm always overestimating and I'm doing worst case scenario. So on my second client, 2000 minus 200, I made 1800. This is how the numbers work. You get paid up front, you purchase your kit, and then by your second, home staging installation, you are in profit. This is gross profit, 1800. Now that's charging 2000, what if you charge 3000, 4000, 5000? We charge loads of different prices depending on the property and depending on the package pricing we've worked out. Now I'm not gonna cover today how to choose your pricing or price your services. We do all of that inside our program, Staging Business Secrets which is our 12 week coaching program. But this is an example if on average, I was to charge 2000. So how does this work in terms of replacing my income? Let me walk you through it. Okay, so my first installation, remember I'm getting paid 2000. Okay, this is what I'm paid. This is my expenses. And this is my profit, okay? So on my first, I get paid 2,000. My expenses are 2,000 because I buy the kit. My profit is zero. 
My second client or my second property, I get paid 2,000. I spend 200 because it's 10%. My profit is 1,800. My third, 2,000. Oh, that's meant to say 200, 200. 3,600, sorry, this is actually what's in my bank account. Okay, because that's another 1,800. My fourth, 2,000, 200. This then goes up to 5,400, so on, so forth, right? Now, I can do this in one year. I can do this eight times. Why can I rent that staging kit eight times? Because remember, if there's 52 weeks in a year, and I divide that by six weeks, then the answer is eight point something or whatever. But we can't rent our kit eight point. <laughs> so if I do eight times six, that equals 48, 48 weeks. So I can rent my kit eight times in one year because that means my kit is total rented for 48 weeks. So I can do this eight times. Now when I do it eight times, here's what happens. When I do my eighth installation and get paid 2,000 again and I spend my 200 after the sixth, seventh and eighth, what's in my bank account now is 12,600. I am earning £12,600 pounds, whatever you want to say, from an investment of zero. And I now have that kit that I can continue to rent year on year on year. And remember by year two, you've even got more profit because the first time round, your expenses are back down to 200. I've created 12,500 in income with a zero of my own money. Tell me another business, tell me an investment you can do that, put in zero money, and at the end of the year, walk away with 12,500. Now that's just one kit. That would be doing eight stages a year. You have capacity to do more than eight stages a year. Because what you do is you get more kits. Now, we have clients who have 10 kits. We have some clients who've built up a stock of 20 kits and are doing this. So with one kit, if I charge 2,000, and remember, you could do this on 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 10,000, depending on your pricing. If I do this with these kits, with one kit, eight stages a year, my income for the year would be my 12,600. What if I get another kit and just repeat that process that I walked you through? So now I have two kits, meaning I can now do 16 stages a year and I double my capacity in earnings. I can now earn 25,200. My, if I get another kit, three kits, this is only 16 a year. This isn't even two stages a month. If I have three kits, I can now do two stages a month, and this equals 37,800. Four kits, five kits, if I'm working on five kits, I can do 40 stages and earn 63,000 in a year. We have clients having 10 kits, that would be double that, that would be 126,000 in gross profit. Guys, this business model works. And this is how we work out. The number that you wanna know is how many stages do I need to do each year in order to replace my income? Now, if you say that the average you wanna charge is 2,000 and your salary is around about 37,000 a year, I've just given you the answer. If you need to do 24 stages a year, if this is you, this is two stages a month. A stage takes 24 hours tops. My team can do it in a few hours because we do this every single day and have been doing it for almost a decade. 24 days in a year. 
the average person I think works 260 days off the year. This is 240 days less than what you currently do in your nine to five. Now, of course, there's gonna be more work to do. You don't only just stage, you need to do marketing and admin, but even if that was another 50 days, it's still like 180 less or 170 less, whatever the number is, than what you're currently doing. So this works. Now, I'm gonna give you a really fun resource that I'm gonna link below, and I'm gonna give you what I call our income calculator. This is an incredibly simple calculator. All you have to do, and you don't need to do all of these workings out, it does it all for you in the formula. All you have to do is insert your salary, and it will tell you. It will tell you how many stages you'd need to do if you charge a thousand, two thousand, three thousand, five thousand, ten thousand. It has worked it all out for you. So I'm going to link that below. Go we'll use that because this is the first part of the process. The first part of the process is you need to know the numbers. You need to know exactly how many stages you need per year to replace your income. So let's say the answer is tw uh, 24. You need to do, let's say you need to do 24 stages a year. That means in a six month period, so let's divide it by two, in a six month period, you need to do 12 stages. You wanna leave your job in six months, you need to secure 12 stages. That's all. Now, I've got a whole training on, this doesn't mean 12 clients, this can be 12 properties with one client. I'm gonna link that below so you can go and check out that training because that's really exciting. But 12 stages in six months is two stages a month to achieve. So you need to know that exact figure. Number one is know the exact figure of staging that you need to do in order to replace your income. Now guys, yes, this is a formula. You might at one point charge 3,200 and great, you've made more profit. We can only do this formula based, but when you work out your pricing, which we teach in our program, you're gonna have an average of how much you charge, right? So this is the first part. It's knowing your figures, knowing how many stages it is per year to replace your income, dividing that by two, and you will know your six month goal. Okay, that's part one. Now the second part is, well, first of the second part is knowing when to quit or when to stick in your job, okay? So this isn't so much a formula. Well, I guess it could be. So there's a few ways to work this out. Some people just go all in. And I, this is not for a lot of people just to completely quit and go all in. So this is not a recommendation. I'm not telling you to do anything. Some people just quit and go all in because then they have every hour of the day to work on their business. The second person, and this is what I advise many of my clients to do, is once you have replaced your income at 80%, so for really easy figures, let's say you earn a thousand a month in your job, it's likely more than that. When you have replaced 800 of it for three months in a row, that's when you take the leap. That's when you leave the job. Because if you've replaced 80% of your income with doing this on the site, in the nights, in the early mornings, at the weekends, when you go full time, think about how you can amp up that income. If this is part time replacing 80%, my goodness, when you give it all of your time, full time, you will smash that goal. So when you have replaced 80% of your income for three months in a row, that is your big point. That is where you say, I'm out, I'm gone, because now I'm ready to give this my all. 
And on that note, I want to I wanna note that when you follow this plan for six months, this is not going to be easy. You're going to be more time poor than ever before. Because now you work your nine to five and you build a business on the side. So if you work nine to five, you better start getting up earlier before work. Maybe you've got kids, maybe that's challenging. Work when they go to bed. You might have to sacrifice Saturdays, Sundays, Saturday mornings, start waking up at 4 a.m. There's gonna have to be sacrifice for six months to get out of the spot you don't wanna be in. So I'm not saying this is easy. I'm not saying you're gonna be rich immediately. You're gonna have massive success or you're gonna have loads of time with your family, not up front. Up front, you're gonna be time poor. On the back end of building your business, you're gonna have more time and flexibility with your schedule than you have ever known if you've been employed for your whole life. You can schedule your stages around your kids. You can bring your kids on the stages. You can schedule this to your schedule in your life once you've built the business, once you have replaced the income. Okay, does that make sense? So guys, you're gonna get the calculator, you're gonna work out how to replace your income, how many stages. You're gonna work out what is 80% of my income and when I hit that three months in a row, that is break point. Now the third part of the method is, I'm loving doing this old school, I feel like it's a teacher, is the action plan. This is going to be a six month sprint. When you think about a sprint, you put all of your energy in. Now the time of recording this is February. In six months time, March, April, May, June, July, August, the start of September, picture this, get into the vision. The start of September, you've left your job. You now run your staging business every damn day. How does that sound? Now when we can tie ourselves and commit ourselves and really feel how that will feel in September, you will go all in today and you will follow this action plan. You will live it, you'll breathe it, you'll make the sacrifices, you'll wake up early, you'll give up the weekends. So the way the six months is built out, it's 24 weeks. Now, if we break that down into weekly, here's what I'm gonna say. Your first six weeks are gonna be launch, okay? So only by week six are you ready to take on your first client. But can I also say having a fully built, ready to go business in six weeks? Hell yes, I'll take that. People take months, years to set up these businesses. But the best time to plant a tree was 20 years ago, the next best time is today. So six weeks, you're gonna launch. Which gives you a leftover 18 weeks to get clients. This is all clients. This is purely sales. This is all you focus on in the start of your business. Once everything's set up, how do I get clients? How do I make sales, okay? So if we break this down, our first six weeks of launch, at Stage Your Boss, we teach the six week launch blueprint. This is my signature method of how to launch your staging business in six weeks. We teach this and handhold you throughout it with coaching in our program, Staging Business Secrets. Now I'm gonna give you a breakdown of what it looks like, but if you're ready to go all in, all in you wanna really be in that launch period, we guide you through it. I'm gonna share with you in this free training what it looks like. So, week one is your foundations. Okay, the first six weeks, week one is foundations. This is pricing. This is knowing your numbers in general. This is services. This is knowing your services. There's four services you can offer in your staging business, we need to break it down into what is gonna be your signature main service that you become the expert in. 
So the foundations is building all of that out. What am I building? What is my pricing so I can get more specific on part one of the method, which is how much money do I need to replace? Or how many stages do I need to do a year? This is week one. Week two is systems. Now, not many people who are business coaches teach you to set up the systems at the start of your business. I'm different, I do. Your staging business, there's many moving parts. It's logistical, there's parts to do. I know when you get into those 18 weeks, you're gonna get clients and you're gonna be going through a massive learning curve. There's gonna be so much happening that systems and everything are gonna go out the window unless they're set up originally. So in your systems, you're gonna be setting up the foundational systems, you're gonna take the financial systems and make sure they're working <laughs> so that you can get paid and actually take the money and then we're gonna work out day-to-day -day systems. What systems do I need to have daily that work inside my business so when that client pays me, when that stage comes off, I'm not overwhelmed, burning out and burning the client, right? The third week, and guys, this is a six week sprint because you need 18 weeks to get those clients. Systems, branding, we need to have a brand. Guys, this is what it says on the tin, is designing that brand, is creating that brand feel, is working out why you're unique in the marketplace, but also who am I working with? Who am I working with? Who am I targeting? If you speak to everyone, you speak to no one, all marketing starts with who. We need to know exactly who we're talking to. Week four is in the setup. This is the setup of socials and some other things. Websites aren't necessary whatsoever, but you can do it here. And we've got some other things that need to set up in the business to make it work. For people to find you. And then, this is our two exciting weeks. Week five, we get into pre-launch. So you build a pre-launch campaign around the business, build up excitement, Many of our clients get clients in the pre-launch phase. Many of our students get their clients in these two weeks. And then week six is launch. This is when this triggers the next part of the process, which is marketing, it's sales, and it's getting clients. So guys, this process, this is your first six weeks. The next 18 weeks, we take our clients through what we call a daily dashboard. That daily dashboard is what you should be doing every single day for the next 18 weeks to replace your income. And that is all the marketing strategies from social media, networking, and reach outs, partnerships, direct mail, how you should be connecting to get those clients so that you can hit that point where your staging business income overtakes your nine to five income. So it's 16 weeks and then beyond this, it's 18 weeks. And this is 18 weeks of all out massive action. Aoma, <laughs> right? That's how you do this in six months. You know your numbers, how many properties, you work out what is my breaking point when I leave, and then you implement the six month. The six weeks gets you started. And from this training video, I'm inviting you to personally join us in our next round of Staging Business Secrets where we're gonna be helping women walk you through this process. There's a whole training curriculum behind it. You don't need any guesswork. It's all laid out in our training program and you receive one-to-one -one coaching and group accountability so that we can help you on that journey and really hold your hand so that by week six, you are launched and in six months, you have replaced that income. We actually support you for 12 weeks. So that is our Staging Business Secrets program. We walk hundreds of women through this process every single year. And if you've been called by this training, you could be the next one. So what I want you to do is I want you to comment below, quit my job, and my team will reach out to you with the next steps to have a chat about joining us in our next cohort of Staging Business Secrets and to leave your job in six months. 
in six months time your life can be completely different you can be living a completely different reality with a completely different financial blueprint and view of what your life's going to mean and also do something you love and feel truly lit up this is your time to shine go comment below quit my job my team will reach out and we can get you onboarded to join us in this process to leave your job guys this has been our training thank you so much any questions put them in the comments below and yeah i'll see you very very soon subscribe for more